who I am with Alpha and Omega You are Yahweh, Alpha and Omega. You are Yahweh, you are Yahweh, you are Yahweh. The Alpha and Omega. You are Yahweh, Alpha and Omega. You are Yahweh. You are Yahweh. You are Yahweh, Alpha and Omega. You are Yahweh, Alpha and Omega. O Kalababa Shanaya, nobody can bear the name you bear. Nobody can wear the crown you wear. Nobody can enter the place you enter. Eka shabalana masupa lataira. Nobody can bear the name you bear. Nobody can wear the crown on your head. Nobody can enter the place you enter. Eka la baba ba shanta lida da baha. Era kosida da ba shananta elegante. Zika tala baba shanai na maha. Ero gonza manta liga da bara kosha. Elemente liga da ba zokoto. Irekente liga na ma suprehendes. Zaka tala baba ba shanai. Iana ma sukelebrahande. We bless your name, Jesus. Rakoshi katai. Ela manta zika tele de bosunaya elana mazuka taya baha igada lene musiana na mahai regene ne mushataya we worship you ancient of days zika na masha igabana tai elemente zekenta liga na mahaya rego zuka na bayana we exalt your mighty name we seek rain lord rako shataya Every tongue in heaven and earth shall declare your glory. Every knee shall bow at your throne. In worship you will be exalted, O God. And your kingdom shall not pass away. Oh, a shant of days. Ah, a balana na sukatala baba bashana na mahaya. Every tongue in heaven and earth shall declare your glory. Every knee shall bow at your throne. In worship you will be exalted, O oh God. And your kingdom shall not pass away. Oh, every tongue, every tongue in heaven and earth shall declare your glory. Every knee shall bow at your throne. In worship you will be exalted, O oh God. And your kingdom shall not pass away. 
Oh, ancient of days, Amala Nashataya. We worship you, ancient of days. We give you all the glory, mighty God. We bless your name, Jehovah. We worship you. We hail you most high. We worship you. We hail you. We hail you. We hail you, we worship you, we hail you, we worship you. Rako shigana na masubalata, erregente zika talaba pashana, irokonto libana neya, elebente zika taya. We hail you, we worship you, we hail you most high. Elanaya, there is none like you. You rege de 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 bosha igana na masutai elegante riga da baba shatai rege ne ne mosi ana na mahai elegon sokota la bahai erekenta lida bazuka tei makata igabala tai regente liga na masuprehendas elakuzi kata na mama shata erokonto librehande izeke ne ne mosi kala tai iyama na kusuana niana lekente igabalate mandala katai erregente zika na namashata igalala ba supalai marekete rekonta maleko satai the most high god the ruler of the universe irakata zakata la namasika late mande de de bo satai rekete igabalana Iana Namasha Zokoto, we worship you, Rose of Shalom, Elohim Adonai, Malekete, the bride and the morning star, Ikalatana, Zuka Nenemo Shataya, Zemenemo Shataya, the great and mighty one, Ela Baba Shadai. <clears throat> The multi-breasted one, Igamanataya, the one who's seated in heaven and makes the earth his footstool. Come on, family. Go ahead and give the Lord a worship. Go ahead and thank the Lord for an opportunity to be in his presence. Oh, David says, I was glad when they said to me, let us go into the presence of the Lord. For a few seconds, just lay aside every weight and every burden and worship the King of kings and the Lord of lords the burden lifter the one that can change your situation within a, within a twinkle of an eye just keep aside every worry every burden and just worship Elohim worship the monarch of the universe the one who's seated in heaven and makes the earth his footstool yes he is the great I am Lakadababa Shataya. He says he is the I am that I am. He is everything you could ever think of. Zika na mama Shataya. Elekoto rakate. Marako zika taya. Mande de de wo Shatana mahaya. Yes, family, let your worship go up. Ananakotaya. I always say I cannot worship God for you. You can worship God for yourself. Only you can worship God for yourself. I can only lead you in an atmosphere of worship, but you alone can worship him in spirit and in truth. The God who says a thing and brings it to pass. Hey, Mama Shataya, the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, the Rock of Ages, Rakata, Ikalataya, Mandede de Boshataya, the solid foundations on which, on which we stand, the sure foundation. Iganana Sopahande, Malede Bo Zubrahandaya. 
Elenemosata Regenemosiana Namahai Makata Erokoto Malekete Marakata When worship goes up, his presence comes down. When worship goes up, his presence comes down. E Amakaya Zina Malate Lananamasha Egada Babasha. We worship you, Jesus. Nobody can bear the name you bear. Nobody can wear the crown you wear. Nobody can enter the place you enter. Oh, Kalababa Shanana Namahaya. Nobody can bear the name you bear. Nobody can wear the crown on your head. Nobody can enter the place you enter. You are the extraordinary strategist. The impossibility specialist. You are seated, seated in heaven. You make my life your footstool. What a mighty God you are. We thank you, Abba Father, for your presence. We know you are here, precious Holy Spirit. We know you are here, Holy Ghost. We know you are here. We know you are here. We thank you for your awesome presence. We thank you for your awesome presence. Rakataya, the burden bearer, the burden lifter. Zima nanamashai, regenenemoshataya, alanamaya. What a mighty God we serve. Heaven and earth adore him. The angels, they bow before him. Ekadabashataya, malenemosuprahandeya. We thank you for your presence. Holy Spirit, you are welcome in our midst. Abba Father, we thank you. Rakatai, Zikatalai, Elekuna Mamaya, Rekota Lababalata, Zekenemenemosha, Rakotaya, in the mighty name of Jesus. Abba Father, we thank you. Oh, King of Glory, we bless and we exalt your mighty name. Alake da Baba Sukalate, Rekonono Suprahande, Ayamanataya, the miracle walking God, Zakate de Debosha. Makede de de bo sulianai erokonto zemenete ikalada balate rakosi ananamaha elekente la mahandia. Zukatala Baba Baha Rekente Zikana Mashataya. We thank you for your presence. We thank you, Holy Spirit of the Living God. Oh my lady bo shinda la baba. Elene mo zika tala baba shaya. In the mighty name of Jesus. And God says, suddenly, it, it shall come to pass. Suddenly, it will happen. Suddenly, it shall come to pass. Suddenly, it will happen. Just as he told you. Just as the prophet told you. Just as you saw it in your dreams. Just as the Lord himself told you. Just as the prophecy came out. Eyamanashadalabaha. The Bible says, such as the word that leaves my mouth, they shall not return to me void without accomplishing the purpose for which they were sent. God is here to reassure someone in this life session that just like you heard that prophetic word, just like you saw it in your dream and in your vision, it is coming to pass. It will happen suddenly. It it will happen suddenly. It will happen suddenly. It will happen suddenly. It will happen suddenly. In the mighty name of Jesus. It will happen suddenly. And your testimony will be resounding. Your testimony will be on the lips of everybody. In the book of Isaiah chapter 48 and verse 3. The Bible says, I have declared the former things which happened to Israel in time past. They went forth from my mouth and I proclaimed them. Suddenly I acted 
and they came to pass. Suddenly, I acted, and they came to pass. I will take it again. It says, Isaiah 43, 48 and verse 3. It says, I have declared the former things which happened to Israel in time past. And I want to ask you a question. Has God ever told you a thing and you came to see it in your lifetime? Did God ever tell you something and you saw it happen? It doesn't matter how long it took. Did he tell you something and you saw the manifestations? And so God is saying, I said this to you in time past and it happened and I am saying it to you again and shadai melene mo subrahandaya he says, they went forth from my mouth and I proclaimed them. Suddenly I acted. They came to pass. Suddenly I acted. They came to pass. God bless you all family. I was just carried away with this, in the spirit and I didn't even have to say hello to everybody. God bless everyone that is joining this live session. God bless you. Thank you so much for joining. I am elated to have you here. As you can see, I am filled up and fired up for us to pray and believe God for sudden, sudden manifestation station of prophecies. I am fired up in my spirit. So please just go ahead and touch the like button if you're yet to do that. And you can share this live broadcast, invite someone, be the reason why someone prays with us. And God is going to bless you. That is called online evangelism. You can share on your timeline, on your status. You can share however and wherever you want to do that. And just be the reason why someone joins us. Hallelujah. God says that, you know, there are certain times in in your life where you get to a point where you start doubting the very prophecies you have heard because they seem to be delaying you get to a point where you start asking yourself is this going to happen i don't know about you but i have found myself in places i have found myself in a place where i start doubting the very voice of god that i heard there are things god told me audibly but because it took so much time to manifest i start asking myself is this even going to happen did i hear god ride was that the voice of the Lord or it was my mind. There are times that you have received prophetic words and they were confirmed to you. There are times that you have seen things. Some of you, you have dreamlands. God had shown you things in your dreamland and you knew it was going to happen. You were certain because your dreams actually manifest. But it is, it is taking a while and you are in a position you are asking yourself, is this even true? Would this happen? Do I even stand a chance? You know what? Sometimes, yes, I know that the devil does fight. I was speaking with someone the other day and she said, yes, I know the devil does fight. The devil fights uh, and prophecies. The devil fights your testimonies. But God is sovereign. I believe in the sovereignty of God. I believe in the sovereignty of God because the Bible says all things work together for good to they that love God and accord according to his purpose. So even if the devil is fighting the manifestation of your prophecy God is permitting it to happen at that time because it is not yet time for the manifestation God is letting the devil fight because he's trying to still work out something either in you or in or in that person or there is still a process that you are going through but I believe in the sovereignty of God I believe that if he says something it shall surely come to pass he says so are the words that leave my mouth out. They shall not return to me void without accomplishing the purpose for which it was sent. God says he had spoken in time past and you saw the manifestation, be it big or small. Maybe he told you your kingdom's spouse was going to call you and he did call you. Maybe he told you you were going to have that job and you had it. Maybe he told you you were going to travel to another state to another country and it did happen I don't know what is that thing that God had told you and you saw the manifestation. He is reminding you that he is still the same God that said it and it came to pass. And there are other things God has told you. You are yet to see the manifestation. But the Lord sent me to tell you that it will happen suddenly. It will happen suddenly. It will happen suddenly. He says suddenly. Suddenly, I acted and they came to pass. Suddenly, I acted. 
acted and they came to pass. Suddenly, I acted and they came to pass. That is going to be your testimony. Your testimony will be suddenly the Lord did it for me. Suddenly, the Lord did it for me. Suddenly, I got married. Suddenly, I received a contract. Suddenly, I was healed of that terminal disease that the hospital said there was nothing they could do about it. Suddenly, my child came back home to me. Suddenly, my kingdom spouse, re my, 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 my prodigal reappeared in my life. Suddenly, Shanai, Ziga Nanama Shabalataya, Ereke de Debo Sumanataya. God is doing sudden miracles. God is doing sudden miracles in the life of his children. Sudden miracles. Sudden miracles. Sudden miracles. Mareke de Debo Shataya. Our God is a God of revelation and prophecy. Our God is a God of revelation and prophecy. God will not say something if he doesn't have the intention to make it happen. God will not say something if he doesn't have the ability to make it happen. God will not say something and it doesn't happen. Except on except it wasn't the voice of the Lord you heard, except that wasn't the voice of the Lord you heard. But if that was the voice of the Lord you heard, then it is about to happen. And the Lord says, somebody, you are in that season. You are in that season of sudden manifestation. You are in that season of sudden manifestation. God is about to exercise his sovereignty over your life. God is about to exercise his sovereignty over your life. God is raka Touch the like button, family. Touch the like button, family, as I begin to pray and make prophetic intercessions. Rako Zamanatai. Some of you, God is opening your spiritual eyes and your spiritual ears to begin to hear prophetic messages for yourself and to hear prophetic instructions that will open the doors to your miracles. God is opening your ears. You are going to hear what next to do that will open you up to a miracle. Rekada Baba Shana. Zik. I pray for you. May God open your spiritual eyes and your spiritual ears that you may hear the next instruction and the next message that God has for you. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Some of you, God is increasing your perception. You shall be able to hear the voice of God even in the midst of distraction, even in the midst of noise. You will be able to hear the voice of God clearly. God is sharpening your perception. I am praying for you as you connect to, to the sound of my voice and to the power of God in this life session. God is sharpening your perception. You shall begin to hear the voice of the Lord audibly, even in distraction, even in chaotic moments. In the mighty name of Jesus, God is giving you wisdom to be able to understand the things he tells you because certain times God gives us instructions and we cannot we, we cannot follow and because we cannot follow we cannot cue into our miracles I pray for you in the name of Jesus God is giving you wisdom and understanding to grasp the meaning of the things he is telling you the Bible Bible says we understand in parts. So there are times that God might give you an instruction you might not understand it fully. You need wisdom from God to be able to understand what you have to do. Zakata, I pray for you. God is giving you wisdom to understand what you have to do per time. In the mighty name of Jesus, God is giving you wisdom to understand what you have to do per time to attract your sudden miracle. The Bible says the source of Issachar, they had a special ability to understand the times and season. They knew what Israel ought to do at every given point. When you know what to do at every given point, miracles become your daily life. When you know what to do at every given point, miracle becomes your regular day life. I pray for you. God is giving you wisdom. I don't see people receiving. God is giving you wisdom. 
God is giving you wisdom. You shall know what to do to attract that that sudden miracle. Rakasha barakate mande de 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 boshai reke de 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 boshai makata zikata ya. I pray for you under the sound of my voice. Every prophetic message that you have received, may God begin to fulfill it in your life in the name of Jesus. May it begin to spring forth. Arakataya. Every prophetic message that you have received that is due, let there be a sudden miracle. Let there be a sudden miracle. Rakataya. May God begin to bring in your future blessings. May God begin to bring in your future blessings and breakthrough that has been spoken over your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Marakataya. Every blessing or breakthrough that has been spoken over your life, may God begin to bring it suddenly. Marekete. Igabalataya. May God bring it suddenly. May God bring it suddenly. May God bring it suddenly. In the mighty name of Jesus. May God make, uh, make it happen suddenly. In the mighty name of Jesus. Some of you, you are watching me and your heart is filled with unbelief. You do not believe that God can make it happen suddenly. And that is what is going to stand between you and your miracle. Because you do not believe. You remember the man in the book of First Kings when... Elijah said, there's going to be an overflow. I am paraphrasing. There's going to be abundance. And the man said, and, 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 and I think he was an, an officer. He said, even if God opened the windows of heaven, it is not possible. What is going to prevent you from accessing this sudden miracle, this sudden happenings in your life is your doubt. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. May God remove every form of doubt and unbelief that may hinder the manifestations of your prophetic word. Rako Shabalataya. I pray, I make a prophetic intercessor. Intercession. As your intercessor, I make a prophetic intercession. May God remove every doubt and unbelief that might hinder you, that might hinder you from the manifestation of your prophetic word. Rakashai. Zikatanamaha. Elekele Balataya. Raganda Baleteya. Zukataya. I pray against any form of unbelief zina mashai erokoto against any form of doubt i make a prophetic intercession rakataya zikatalatai marekete malakaya zikanaya father bypass their doubt and unbelief zakana masha zukalabaya erokoto mande de de bosha regede de de bosha zina namashaya iyama mamashaya Rakataya, regenene moshatai. Mareko Shatai, Iyama Masha, Rekete de Boswa, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, Maleko Taya Baba Bashatai, Iyama Mama Sobrahandaya, Rekete Nene Moshatai, someone under the sound of my voice, the voice of the Lord is acting as a light unto your as a lamb unto your path and a light on as a light unto your path and a lamb unto your feet the word of god as from today you are going to hear prophetic instructions that are going to guide your movement you are going to hear prophetic instructions god is going to tell you go this way write an application like this do it this way go to this place say this thing to this person as from today the the word of God is going to act like a lamp to your feet and a light to your path. No longer shall you walk in darkness. God will be giving you specific instructions that is going to land you into a mighty miracle. That is the word for somebody. That is the word for somebody. That is the word for somebody. God says you will no longer walk in darkness. God says you will no longer walk in darkness. You will no longer walk in darkness. 
He will direct your path. He will tell you what to do. He will tell you how to do it. Your ears are opening to hear God. Your eyes are opening to see God. Your ears are opening to hear God. Your eyes are opening to see God. The voice of the Lord will lead you. It will be like a lamp to your path, like a light to your path and a lamp to your feet. No longer will you be go on in darkness. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray for you. There is someone, you guys, you are listening to me and they are prophetic messages you have heard and it seems like it is not happening. You have heard prophetic word. As a matter of fact, you are so dissatisfied. As a matter of fact, you don't know, you don't even want to hear prophecies anymore. You are saying, let the previous ones manifest. I do no longer even believe in prophecies. Based on the word of God, he says, Sought are the words that leave my mouth. They shall not return to me void. Your prophetic words will not return to the Lord void without accomplishing the purpose for which it was sent in the mighty name of Jesus. The prophetic words that have been released to you, they will not return to God without accomplishing the purpose for which it was sent. In the mighty name of Jesus, suddenly God will act and it will come to pass. Suddenly God will act and it will come to pass. Suddenly God will act and it will come to pass. In the mighty name of Jesus, suddenly God will act and it will come to pass. I pray for you. I make prophetic intercessions. Suddenly, 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 God will act and it shall come to pass in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus, suddenly God will act and it shall come to pass in your life. Suddenly God will act and it shall come to pass in your life. Suddenly God will act and it shall come to pass. Suddenly God will act and it shall come to pass. Lakana mama shataya. God will accomplish the purpose. God will accomplish those prophetic words that have been released to you. It will happen. It will happen. It will happen. Maledebo shanana mahai. It is happening. Suddenly. Suddenly. Suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. Suddenly the Lord will do it and it shall come to pass. Oh, I need people who have faith in the house to join me and begin to confess it. Say, suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. Suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. I need people of faith to go ahead and begin to confess it. Say, suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. I don't know what is that word you heard and it seems like it is never happening. Suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass in the mighty name of Jesus. Suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. Ega baba shata le be 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 bo sinta ya iya na na ma shaka de 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 bo shanaira rekete ne ne mo shana mahaya. Suddenly God will do it and it shall come to pass. I feel so excited in my spirit. I don't know who 
I am excited for. I don't know who is about to experience that sudden miracle. Suddenly, suddenly, suddenly. But that is how your testimony will come. Agababa Santalada, Iganana Satanadia, Eroko Zanate, Iganana Supalataina. Suddenly, God will do it and it shall come to pass for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Suddenly, suddenly, God will do it and it shall come to pass in the mighty name of Jesus. Suddenly, God will do it and it shall come to pass. Your testimony is near. 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 Oh, Galababa Shanana Mahaya. Your testimony is near. Eda Baba Sunana Mashataya. As you believe it and connect yourself to these prophetic prayers, your testimony is near in the mighty name of Jesus. Your testimony is near in the mighty name of Jesus. Your testimony, Ayana Kobala Namashata. Your testimony is near in the mighty name of Jesus. Egabala namasu para nashida da bahai. Mendele de boza kanta nene kupalatia erokotoyo. Your testimony is near in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Family, go ahead and begin to thank the Lord. Celebrate the doer of all miracles. Thank the Lord. Thanksgiving is an act of faith. When you thank God for what he is yet to do, you are pushing him to the edge. When you thank God for what he is yet to do, you are pushing him to the edge. You are, you are pushing him to that point where he does it. When you thank him, that is why you've got to be as intentional with your thanksgiving, even as you were with your amen and with your prayers. Go ahead and thank the Lord. Akadaba Shantaya. Mendele de Bozo Brahandi. Ikatala Baba Santo Librahandia. Elekonono Mosu Balatai. Father, we thank you. We give you all the praise, Lord, for sudden manifestations of prophetic words. We thank you, Lord, for sudden for sudden happenings. We thank you, Lord, for our testimonies that are near. We thank you, Abba Father, for what you are about to do. We give you all the praise because your sovereignty is about to be manifested in our lives. We thank you, Egadaba Shananadi Adai, Iroko Shanante, Elemeneko Zikate, Rekonono Supalataina, in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. Hallelujah, glory to Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Let's pray for the offerings. People are already planting connection seeds, connecting to the prophetic prayer. Father, Lord, we thank you for the giving of your people. Thank you for everyone that has given an offering on PayPal, on Cash App, or mobile money. I pray that you bless their giving in the mighty name of Jesus. May their bands never run dry in the mighty name of Jesus. Those who are planting prophetic seeds, connecting to the prophetic prayers, I pray for you in the name of Jesus. May the Lord honor your giving. May the Lord honor your giving. And may he establish his word in your life. Whatsoever you are connecting for, I pray may the Lord honor your giving. Those who are connecting to no longer will I walk in darkness. I connect you to your seed in the name of Jesus. And I pray may God honor your giving. No longer will you walk in darkness. In the mighty name of Jesus. Those who are planting seeds to God, opening your spiritual eyes and your spiritual ears, I connect to your seed. May the Lord open your spiritual eyes and ears in the mighty name of Jesus. Those who are planting prophetic word, those who are planting seeds and they are connecting to fulfillment of life prophecy. I connect you to your seed. May the Lord honor your giving and may he fulfill 
the prophecies that have come to you in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Those who are planting seeds and connecting to my testimony is near. I connect you to your seed. May the Lord give you a testimony speedily in the mighty name of Jesus. Those who are planting seeds, connecting to sudden miracle. I connect you to your seed. Let there be a sudden miracle in the mighty name of Jesus. I bless your donations in the mighty name of Jesus. I bless your giving. Those who have given and paid their tithes on pay power and on cash of your tithes are blessed in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that God will rebuke the devourer over your income and that he will open the windows of heaven and pour out a blessing that your bands will not be able to contain in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You are blessed of God. You are blessed beyond curse. It is happening speedily for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's take our daily declarations together. The favor of the Lord is upon me. My hands and my feet are anointed for exploits. The favor of the Lord is upon me. My hands and my feet are anointed for exploits. The favor of the Lord is upon me. My hands and my feet are anointed for exploits in the mighty name of Jesus. Before we share the grace, this is the season I'll keep announcing until it is past the season. Because I know that, you know, God bless all our first timers. Let me start by welcoming all our first timers. If this is the first time you are joining us, God bless you. Thank you so much for joining. Please check to see if you're already a part of this family. If you are not yet subscribed, please kindly go ahead and subscribe right now. Do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that each time we are live or there is a release of a prophetic word, you are going to um, receive a notification. And if you're yet to give the video a thumbs up, please go ahead and touch the like button. God bless you as you do that in the mighty name of Jesus. I want to start by appreciating those who are reaching out for our scholarship program that is coming up in a few weeks. Thank you so much for reaching out. Nothing is too small and nothing is too big. Thank you so much. I, 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 I am very grateful and I see your response. When I see people responding towards that, it makes me to know that I am not alone. We are partnering in doing this. I have a burden seriously. I have a serious burden for um, children and they are back to school. I have a serious burden and I'm hoping that we can together put a smile on the faces of many children and parents as well because I know how parents can be devastated when you don't when you are not in a position or when you do not have enough to help you know, to pay for your children's tuition, to buy their school accessories. I know how demoralizing that can be. So I am still calling on partners. If you want to partner with me for our back to school scholarship program, please go ahead and do that. You can reach out on email. You can do that on PayPal, on Cash App. However you want to do it, God is going to bless you. As you help these children to do what they cannot do for themselves, God is going to do for you what you cannot do for yourself. As you help them, as you put a smile on their face by relieving the burden of their parents who do not even have, God is going to put a smile on your face as well. So nothing is too small and nothing is too big. Nothing is too small. Please partner with me for this back to school campaign and God will bless you mightily. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you blessed? Are you blessed, family? Are you blessed? Now may the Lord bless you and keep you, cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. God bless you, family. I love you so much. Please, let's keep the thumbs up coming. Let's keep the thumbs up coming. If you're here to touch the like button, let's keep the thumbs up coming. God bless you as you do that. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. God bless you, family. God bless each and every one of you. 
I love you so much. I will see you in our next live session as God gives me grace. Until then, have an amazing evening, family, or have an amazing day. Those who are still going to sleep right now, I pray that you are going to have encounters with angels. Those who are still planting their seeds on PayPal and on Cash App, God bless your seed in the name of Jesus. May the Lord honor your giving and grant the desires of your heart. Whatever you are believing him for, may he honor your giving and grant the desires of your heart in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Shalom, family.